are the main ingredients for the apple dumplings. It's two Granny Smith apples, two cans of crescents, and about half of this, which seems like a weird mix, but it works out. And again, stick butter is much better, but item out. And also you cannot use real butter. I tried once and it did not turn out. You have to use margarine. The original Pioneer Woman recipe calls for a cup of sugar, but I add about a cup and a half of sugar. I think it's better and we like sweets, I guess. And the recipe says a teaspoon of vanilla. I just kinda, you know, eye it. I don't know, I like vanilla and there you go. Okay, so the secret really is, I think, that you don't want the sugar to completely dissolve. You just want it to still kind of be granulated in there. So you just barely stir it, which is also why you're supposed to let the butter melt and then add the sugar in, because then you just barely stir it up. So I messed up, but that's the way you're supposed to do it. So while that is, while this is finishing, I spray this with Baker's Joy, which is the one with flour. I just use that for any time I make sweets. And then I'll show you the next step. Just peel the apples and then use one of these to slice it evenly. You need 16 slices of apple because you have 16 crescents. Just roll each crescent around the apple. Start with the wide end down to the small end. This is what it should look like once you get them all rolled up like they're supposed to be. And then you just drizzle this on top over the top of the crescents. I always just take a wooden spoon and make sure to put juice on every one and that there's no dry spots. Now it's time for the magic. Uh, the Mountain Dew, it calls for one can. I never have a can, so I just buy a bottle and I use about half of it. So I probably used a little over half, and this is 20 ounces, so I bet I got about like 12, maybe 14 ounces. Who knows, but that's what it should look like. The last step is to just sprinkle a little bit of cinnamon on the top and you cook it at 350 for about 45 minutes. 